tone for its disappointing effort against the Eagles. The Tigers are currently fourth and now have a sequence of matches at home on the MCG. Tim Gossage is at training tonight and Tim... <laughs> Have a look at you. There wouldn't be too many problems at Punt Road at the moment, but there's a few problems for you. <laughs> you would not believe what's happened here at Punt Road. The players have gone inside. I'm left out here. We're absolutely getting drenched. Mind your own business, Kurt. It's all right for you. Yes, but as you said, not a worry in the world at the moment. They've won their last three games against the Dockers, also St Kilda and Hawthorne. Tonight, a short session, very short in fact. They're now inside and nice and warm, and they'll go for a light run, uh, weather permitting, no doubt. At, not on the track tonight, Michael Gale, Greg Deer and Stuart Whitney. They have been given the night off and they are inside nice and warm at the moment. Some good news is for the uh, Richmond fans is that the May 6th game between Collingwood has officially been transferred to the MCG. That'll give the club five matches in a row at the Hello Turf. That's good news for everyone. John Northey, well, he's still non-committal about whether they play their best football at the G. Well, we're not sure when you're really growing up in football, and, and that's what we're doing, I feel. You know, it's hard to say which ground suits us. I mean, Waverley over the last few weeks has been tremendous to us and has been in the past. Uh, at the MCG, we've been up and down a little bit, but of course, being what we class as our home ground, we've, we've certainly got to play well there. And, uh, you know, I know it's early to talk about finals. However, all the finals are played there. So, you know, that, that's where we need to play our best football. Thank you, Pete, and good evening. A memorable day for 